Hey guys, it's Andy San here. Um, today's uh, mobile episode is brought to you by AMP. And uh, like I said, it's the uh, this flavor, the uh, the Elevate, which is the blue can, not the purple can, the blue can, is the one I think tastes the most like uh, pitch black. Um, it also kind of tastes like uh, I don't know if you guys remember the uh, the original Democracy flavors from Mountain Dew. Um, the uh, Supernova also tastes like that too, so it's kind of a kind of a weird combination of the two. So uh, yeah, um, <clears throat> let's see. I don't really know what to talk about today because <laughs> uh, you guys know that I got a an NFAX coming out uh, tomorrow. Um, I have to get recording on that, you know, because I slacked off. Uh, so I got to get to recording that, edit it, and upload it. Uh, for your viewing pleasure. Um, let's see. I did a uh, video last night. <clears throat> it was a quick riff idea that I came up with. I was just uh, kicking out the jams after I tuned my guitar back up to uh, E standard. Um, for some reason, uh, that guitar doesn't really hold up well when you down tune. And I know, you know, different string tensions would screw with things, but I've had some pretty cheap-ass guitars in my time, and even those things could, uh, you know, be relatively playable when you down-tune them. You know, heck, even my uh, Squire Strat could stand being put a whole step down. Um, but if you got to C-sharp or below, it would start to kind of fizzle out, so I just mostly stuck with, uh, like, either drop D or... Full D or just E standard on that one. Um, but yeah, uh, a video with uh, with my uh, guitar and amp is uh, probably going to be coming out sometime next week. Um, not really sure what kind of stuff I'll be doing. Maybe going over some riff ideas and the such. Um, also, I have been. Uh, Looking at the uh, the uh, results of uh, the uh, voting uh, dealio that I had going on for my two videos, and uh, so far, you guys uh, really seem to prefer uh, music in the uh, kind of long videos where I'm just talking. Um, so um, that's definitely something to think about. But also. Um, <clears throat> I know that a lot of music I like is uh, licensed, even though it is uh, fairly obscure stuff, it is licensed. So uh, it's going to be kind of tricky to fit it in there, but um, I'll see what I can do. I also like some, uh, you know, unlicensed music, so I can uh, definitely use those and uh, probably figure out some uh, some technical wizardry, as the uh, Talking of Dolkin once put it. And uh, probably squeeze some different tracks in there for uh, future videos. Um, not sure if I'm going to do it for Anfax, though, but that is a possibility. So uh, definitely look forward to something like that in the uh, near future. Um, also, uh, oh, I just remembered. Sorry, it just my brain's kind of fuzzy this morning. But I just remembered. Um, big news. I am going to the... Uh, Al Dimiola concert that's going to be happening here in uh, San Diego on the uh, like the 19th, 29th, I don't know, something with a nine in it. I think it's 19th. Um, I'm I'm going to be going to that. Um, I really, really wanted to go to the Big Four concert, but I know I definitely don't have enough money for that. Um, that's going to be probably around 200 some odd dollars. That's just to get in, you know. And then, you know, obviously I'll want a t-shirt, maybe some extra memorabilia, you know, autographs material, you know, like photos and such. Uh, but uh, that stuff would uh, be a bit out of my price range. Hopefully there's still tickets available so that way maybe I can get it uh, next paycheck. But uh, no guarantees. So I don't know if that one's going to happen. I hope it does. Um, I do have a tax return. It's going to be coming up soon. So that is a possibility, but I'm not really too sure about it right now. Uh, but I am definite about the, uh, the Aldemiola thing. I'm going to 
do the uh, reserve over the weekend so I have a, a spot available and I'm gonna try to get some video of it um, I'm gonna hopefully fingers crossed hopefully uh, maybe get to talk with Al maybe get him to do a little like video promo I mean wouldn't that be some shit you know hey this is Al Damiola here and you're watching the theandysan.com or something like that you know that that would just be awesome you know and uh, that's another thing I'm thinking about is uh, I know uh, you guys really like the uh, intro to some of my uh, more uh, polished videos, I guess you could say, or the ones that I edit instead of my mobile videos, uh, but uh, I'm thinking about maybe redoing it, and uh, <clears throat> one of the ideas that I had was uh, using uh, little promos from various people that I would meet, um, hopefully celebrities, like... Al Di Miola. Um, but I'm also kind of thinking of maybe um, opening it up to you guys where you do like a quick little hey this is so and so and you're watching the you know something like that but um, I'll get into more detail with that later it's still kind of in the uh, embryonic stage I guess you could say so I'm still kind of formulating the idea uh, but tell me what you guys think in the comments you know, if you like the theme, if you want me to change it, like I said, um, if you do want me to change it, uh, kind of figure out what kind of thing you want me to change it to, and stuff like that. But I see this video is getting almost to the seven minute mark, so I'm going to have to end things here. This is the Andy San, signing off for now, thanking you guys, my super special awesome audience, for uh, watching this video, for rating, commenting, subscribing, sending me some uh, awesome questions for uh, future end facts um, uh, keep on sending me more I'm I'm starting to uh, I can see the end if uh, that's any indication you know I can see the end of the questions but um, yeah keep on doing what you're doing uh, tell your friends and as always we'll see you next time bye guys